Caitlin is communicating with some people who are out there to to protest Black Lives Matter, and a lot of a lot of the young people out here are black, all right. Um, but I just want y'all to know something: these people do not represent the black community. They represent the part of the black community that desperately wants some clout, have absolutely no intelligence when it comes to certain um, arguments that they even want to present. Um, and they don't plan on listening to anything. They believe that being out there, being activists, no, they have not believe they've seen how lucrative it can be for someone to just be an ignorant activist because it does pay. It pays to be an ignorant activist. I mean, there's a bunch of people right now that's getting paid more as an activist than they did when they was, you know, playing professional football. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and check this out, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments, all right? The sign's upside down. Oh, sign upside down. Do you guys disavow all of the burning and looting? Black Lives Matter. Will you disavow the burning and the looting? Black Lives, Black Lives Matter. Matter. Disavow the burning and the looting. Black, Black Lives, Lives Matter. Matter. Disavow the murders of police officers. Black, Black Lives Matter. Come oh on. Okay. You can go home now. I don't have to go home. You can go home. Why are you mansplaining? Anyway, there's a lot of protesters out here. No, there's not. There's four of them. And I love them. I think they're great. They're great for content, but I need security around them because, boy, do they get real mad real fast. Go to patreon.com slash Caitlin Bennett to fund my security. I told you guys, everywhere I go, I will have security, and it's up to you to make sure that happens. Promises made. Promises kept. Explaining anything to you? What? What? Am I? Yes, 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 yes. I'm, I'm what? Yes. 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 What? Yes. Yes. Wait, yes. You're a disgrace yes. to women. You're a disgrace. How that? How so? I said yes. How am I a disgrace to, to women? Someone that is that is disgraceful and abysmal and has done horrible things for the spirit of this country. Yes, now saying you, you are a disgrace to, to women. Death. Yes, you are a disgrace. How are you pro life? But you how can you say that if you're a man? You're disgrace. How can you say that if you're a man? To women, everyone knows it. Okay. For you? How? Oh, okay. <laughs> you are literally yeah. profiting. Cool. Yes, I got you. You're profiting off everything that's happening. We're fighting for lives. We have people being literally lives like lives in the womb. Do you care about lives in the womb? Yeah. Do you care about after the? Do you? Yes. You do. So yes. you're pro-life. I'm pro-choice. You're pro-life. Then, if you care about lives in the womb, no, 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 no. then you no, care no, about no, them. No, 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 no. Do not no, mansplain. No, 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 no. Stop. I am talking to her. Oh, you let a man tell you you can't talk to me? You don't know us. You don't give a about us. And I'm done making content for you, but you are a disgrace to women. And I, you can, if you only trust women, then here, trust me, because that's true. Do you believe in women's right to defend themselves with firearms? Huh? Do you believe in gun rights for women? I'm done with your questions. Yes, I think that. I'm a disgrace to women. I believe in a woman's right to defend herself with a firearm. No restrictions on it whatsoever. I know women are strong enough to have a baby, not be coerced into abortion. I know that women do not have to kill their children to succeed. Hey, yo, y'all see the lady, the young girl was saying, I will not give you no content and answer your questions. Then Caitlin turned around and said, okay, and started talking directly to her camera. I said, okay, I'm gonna act like she's not even here. Listen, I'm gonna talk to this camera right here because she said she didn't want to be a part of it. She wasn't giving me any, she was giving me a whole bunch of nonsense and ignorance anyway. She's out of the production. Back to you all. This is why I believe that I represent all women. And they call me a disgraceful woman, but I'm for this, I'm for that, I'm for that. And she's trying to get into the frame now. Like, oh, didn't you say you want to talk to me? Hey, I'm still here. I'm still here. And the people behind her, are they call themselves protesting, but they came out there to have a good time. They came out there to have fun. They came out there to get them a little bit of clout. And they are thanking God that someone with such reach like Caitlyn and then i mean they came out there to talk to them because now they can record them on their phone and get some type of anger riled up like yeah we was here and we were we were able to go back and forth with them 
Man, this girl is way too shot for them. Seed in life, we can be moms and we can have careers and it's okay to just be a mom at the same time. I believe in women not having to be taxed to death by these people. I'm a disgrace to women. I love their definition of what it means to be a disgrace to women because I know what I do empowers women. Somebody call them. And uh, Somebody it's call okay them. to not have an OnlyFans. Hi, can you see six feet away? Six feet away? Six, no, this is not six feet. The sign's upside down. This dude is an idiot. I like her bull cut. Wait, why do they have police sirens if they want to defund the police? I'm triggered. I'm triggered. Where'd you get your mask? I had it made for me for somebody for slut walk. I like it. What's slut walk? To protect the rights of sex workers because those people are disproportionately usually trans, black, poor, and don't have access to other forms of health care. So we call them sluts? Well, that's what it is we purpose as. That's the point of the walk. I just want to know what you're out here protesting today. What about Trump supporters? If you could. Hold on, what? Did I just now miss? This brother <laughs> This brother just now said, I got on this mask for slut walk. <laughs> Who are the sluts that they represent? And, and are the sluts happy and crying? Like, I can't believe y'all are doing this for me. Y'all care for me. Oh, the sluts. Y'all out there representing the sluts. God is good. God is good for representing the sluts. <laughs> <laughs> Slut walk, my God. Man. Talk to them right now, and they're they're listening to you. What would you tell them? So, honestly, the only thing I would tell them is, but he lost. I mean, and the thing is, anti. Look, look, look he lost. Up, they need to get mom. over it. Democracy is when people vote, right? People vote. Yeah. We voted. There's no evidence of fraud at all. There's none. He just lost Texas yesterday. Yeah. Like he just lost Texas. Yeah. Like they they recounted. Yeah. Yeah. He lost. So they recounted. He so lost. you know he lost. He, you know. You know. That wasn't his lawsuit. He lost. The election. That wasn't his lawsuit. Son, it was his lawsuit. It was, it was that was his. his. His election day. I'm sorry. Was it not involved with, with the election? Did it not? That, that lawsuit? That was just Texas Attorney General. Okay, but, but it was for the election, wasn't yes, it? Yes, it was. It was Texas Attorney General. Then who was it? It was Trump's lawsuit. No, it it's was. all over the internet. No, it was, it was not Trump's lawsuit. You guys say there's no evidence of. Regular. You don't even know who's suing. It was Texas Attorney General that was suing other states. They don't even know the lawsuits. To watch the full uncensored version of this video that we can't show here on YouTube and Facebook, go to libertyhangout.tv. It's a good time. Uh, hey, snowflakes. A historical amount of black people came out to vote for Trump. Are they dumb too? Yeah, they are. They are. They are. They are. Why are they dumb? They are. Wrong side of history. What? Wrong side of history. How? He on the wrong side of history. Oh. Wrong side of history. Oh. How? Because he oppresses black people. How does he do that? Oh, God. Can you answer that so question? No, I'm asking you, bit loud mouth. Come on, five, back yourself God. up, big guy. Central Park answer that five. question. He literally pushed the kill five. Exactly. Wow, that dude is the loudest one out there and ain't, ain't trying to speak nothing into it. Like, he just, he just don't know. He's speaking, but he's like, <laughs> wrong side of history. Yeah, the black people that voted for Trump, they dumb too. They wrong side of history. She says, why? Come on, you know why? They on the wrong side of history. Come on, I ain't gonna answer why. Come on, can you, brother, can you please tell me? Come on, help me, help me out, please. Uh, y'all asked me to come out here. Y'all said I would get some free lunch. You ain't tell me I was gonna have to have no packs. Huh? Huh? I spent my good hard money, I, my hard working, I, I earned that money to catch an Uber out here to be with you guys. So you gonna back me up with some facts. I didn't know she was gonna be asking me no questions, man. These youngers, man, they're so damn ignorant. How does he oppress black people? Let's go back to the uh, Central Park Five. We said give him the death penalty. Why do we have to go back all the way there? If he oppresses black people, how does he do that? 
I'm not gonna ask any more of your questions. I'm not gonna ask any more of your questions. Any part of the How does Trump oppress black people? I'm trying to explain it, but every time that I explain it, I'm not asking any more of your questions. Why not? Just one thing. No, she doesn't know. She knows. She just chooses not to. She just chooses not to. So I'll answer this question. People that have to ask this question have a fundamental lack of understanding for American history. Then why can't he answer it? It's very clear that you don't understand what's going on. Then make me understand. Help me understand. That's not my job. I'm not a teacher. Okay. Okay, so none of them have any information. They they gonna try to flip it and say, since you have that question, you are the one that's wrong. All right, when I ask for proof, it's not their job to teach me. How does Trump oppress black people? You don't wanna understand, so I'm not gonna ask tell me. you questions. You don't wanna understand, so I'm not gonna ask any more of your questions. Nixon peddled drugs into the black community, dog. It's the entire I'm talking about Trump. And Trump has, has tried to help the black community get out of prison. All the masks came off. It's systemic, which means that it's generational, oh, I know. which means that there are long-term problems which require long-term solutions. So it's with that understanding of history, you understand that the system does not work. So, so you want Trump out of office? You want Joe Biden in? That's not what I said. You're asking. You, 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 you asked me to answer one question. I'm asking. And now you're asking me to answer a new question. So you have to let me finish the first question. Now you, you want to talk because you want to blame. I'm okay, asking no, about no, no, Trump. No, no. So How does Trump do? oppress you black people? He's a part of a long chain of a system oh, okay. that has been oppressive. Okay. And he magnifies that oppression. How does he do that? It's obviated in everything. And the fact that you're asking this question just for Tax life. cuts oppress the, black the, people? The fact that you're asking this for life. The first setback depresses black people? You're asking this for views? Not asking it for views, bro. Asking is because she's hoping that she will run into someone who just as loudly protests against him, could loudly and proudly back it up with some facts. That's it, bro. But you're not listening, bro. You're, you're not listening at all. You're just trying to change the narrative because you're ignorant. And that's ridiculous. It's crazy when people are doing this and their lives depend on it. This oh, is I really know. shameful. I know. This is really I pathetic. Know. It's so I pathetic that I, that I support that, like, a president who doesn't oppress you, black people. You want people to see you, and that's great, and that this is the hill that you're choosing to die on. You can do so much better. Like, do a makeup tutorial. You do can cooking. do better. Oh, no, I'm, I'm Do cooking. Is that sexist? That's right. No, 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 no. Do a makeup tutorial. You just made a sexist no, joke. No. I'm triggered. You can do anything And I'm telling Facebook. You can do anything that you want. I am a good cook. you don't need to do this. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. No, because I'm good at this. I'm good at exposing your guys' hypocrisy. I'm very good at it. That's why people watch me. Because they love to sit here and see that you guys don't know what you're protesting. You don't know what you're talking about. Because it assuages a feeling of guilt inside them, so they don't have to look any further and do any research. So when you say what they're saying, when you agree with them, it gives them confidence to behave in this way. Behave in your way. We're not looting. We're not burning. We're not raping. We're not trying to go out here and do this stuff. looting, burning, and raping. It's built on it. Okay. No, it's built on winning. Winning, conquering, because there's losers and there's winning. Conquering? Yep. Yep. We won fair and square. You won fair and square. Fair and square. They didn't even evict the circle. Did you see that? Do you believe the polls in 2016? Oh, yeah, I did. We took the loss. We took the loss. You guys refused, and I, when I say you guys, I mean the Democratic Party, the left, no, don't, the don't, left don't, side. No, 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 you're mansplaining. This is toxic. This is toxic masculinity. All right, a woman out here just wanting to speak. These men are attacking me. They're being very misogynistic and they're mansplaining. Can you stop she just, mansplaining? She just told me I was mansplaining, guys. She told me her. Show them your crop right top. Here. She told me. <laughs> This, she came out her face and had the nerve to say that I. You're so mad you took off your mask. I was mansplaining. She, this, this one right here. Hi also, guys, go to patreoncom slash Bennett to support we my work. Got this country fair and square. Yep. And I tried to explain to her that that's how you out hold white supremacy. That's white supremacy. That. Yeah. So take white a good look at her. Hi. Hi guys, I'm here. You go to patreoncom slash Bennett to support my work. Go to LibertyHangout.tv. Oh come on. Oh come on. He ruined my pitch. Anyway, go to LibertyHangout.tv. You can watch. And, and he just not accused her for being out there for likes and views. And that's exactly what he's out there trying to get. He's trying to get some likes and views as an activist. It's just, unfortunately, okay, 
young people, I'm gonna tell you this. If you want to go into um to being an activist, you're gonna have to learn some things behind that. Like you have to back that up with something. If you're fighting for something and um whatever that something is, be well versed on it, man. That's it. If you're gonna be out there fighting for it, be well versed on it. Like I can fight for family. That's what I can do. And I'm extremely well versed on family. That's it. Fight for what you, I mean, believe in what you, if you believe in it, you fully believe in it, then you will do your research. You're saying that people who have to prove you wrong have to do research. And, but then when they present some more information to you, it's going to be more overwhelming for you. And you're just going to be more and more and more and more defensive because you're realizing that all of this information is, is you, you got to find a way to make those people, um, Feel like they're less than simply because you're not even willing to do your own due diligence and that's just horrible man you're you're not doing your own people right by by not taking the time to be prepared come out there prepared next time hopefully years from now you'll be far more prepared because right now Y'all suck. Y'all are horrible, man. Watch the uncensored footage from this little interaction. He's so upset. There's still mansplaining, though. All right. Go to LibertyHangout.tv. If you don't believe in mansplaining and toxic masculinity, go there and support my work. Watch these fools dance around me. They're so upset. Imagine being a grown man and getting bothered so much by a little girl's opinion. I'm going to educate you. Both sides get really hostile. You and I'm going to adjust it too. I was just asking where you were going. Well, she came over here. I was just wondering what, what you were doing in that outfit. That's it. That's we're trying to keep the show starting. Okay. We would love it if you would escort them. So you guys are done with the interview? We don't want the interview. You want to defund the police and you're asking them to escort me away? We don't want them. No, he asked. He said they can stay here as long as people. I said, I don't want you here. Okay. You want the police to do something for you, but you want to defund them. They are here. To to they, no, they came you and just said to escort me away. I mean, no, they came and talked to me. I didn't talk to them. They came and talked to me. Because you guys are grown men no, no, and you're no, so no, upset no. right now over a woman with a different opinion. No, we just what? don't like you. How embarrassing. It has nothing to do with you being a woman. I don't like your aura. How embarrassing. No, I, I don't like your aura. I don't like what the you're hell sexist. you got going on. Oh, I'm sexist. Okay. I don't want her here. That's okay. <laughs> That's okay. But you can stay as long as you want. I know I can. I don't need you to mansplain that. <laughs> That's so sexist. Now I'm being sexually assaulted. Gay people suck too. Gay people suck too. Go ahead, Ariel. Talk. Caleb, hey, how do you go? You. <laughs> Thank you, Ariel. That was so sweet of you. I'll say it again. Maybe next time to your face. <laughs> I'm right here all day. You can come on down, Ariel. She's, she's calling you out. Come on down. She's calling you out, Ariel. She ran out of energy real fast. You either have to accept leftist ideology. Woo! You just blew all your COVID germs all up in my face. Well, you don't have a mask. You don't believe in yourself. Oh, come on. You guys don't have your masks on. I know. I know. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm not going to FaceTime with someone. People have to pay for that. <laughs> Oh, by the way, talking about paying for videos, go to Cameo. All right, so yeah, that's that's all we're gonna cover from this because this right here is just they're not they're not communicating, man. This it's nothing else that um that that I can get from this. I'm I'm sh now people are getting a little bit more irate, and there's more conversations that she's trying to have um, with people, and it's just not getting any better. Um, so yeah, we're gonna end it there, man. Black Lives Matter protesters um and they they just don't know how to back their points up it sucks man y'all know what time it is i want to hear what y'all gotta say about it now in the comments below and if you have yet to hit that subscribe button please make sure you do so on your way out the door once again guys i'm van and now we are all the lfr family and i look forward to seeing you on the next video and hopefully inside the patreon as well y'all have been amazing per usual Love.